we should, the parties should be able to have a consensus and have the two leading candidates to run together. Wow. Yes. That's a very contrarian view. Why? One Baumia and Alan to run together. Yes. For a very simple reason. The simple reason is that for the first time, mm. the two leading candidates also satisfy the north-south divide. divide. You see, if Alan won, he is most likely to choose a running mate from, from the north. north. True. If Baumia won, he is most likely to choose a candidate from the south. Sorry, a running mate from, from the, the south. south. The two of them, they are the leaders. I mean, everybody knows. Mm. The other people coming in, very uh, gentlemen who mm. serve the party mm. well. But when we are talking of the, the two, we've always known the front runners, mm. haven't we? Yeah. In, in, um, in 1992, yeah. it was a Dubuahini and, and uh, Kufu. Uh, Dubuahini won. Mm. In 1996, mm -hmm. it was Idubuahini mm -hmm. and Kufu. Kwame Pienim somewhere until the court case. Kwame Pienim didn't take yeah. that, unfortunately. It was Idubuahini and Kufu Four. again, and this time Kufu won. won. In 1998, the front runners were Kufu and Kufu and, and Kufu won. Mm. There was no primary in 2000. There was no primary in 2004. The primary in 2008, mm -hmm. the front runners were Alan Chiamanti and Akufado. Mm -hmm. Everybody knew it. And indeed, the results showed Akufado won. Alan mm -hmm. was second. The primaries in uh, 2012, mm -hmm. we, knew, we knew the front runners, Alan and Akufado. Mm -hmm. And indeed, they were first and second. 2016. So we've always known the front runners. And the front runners today are Alan and uh, Baumia. Now, in all the previous primaries, the two front runners did not satisfy the North South divide. True. I mean, Edu Bwahini and uh, Kufu didn't the satisfy. South. They were also from the South. Kufu and Akufuado, all from the South. Kufu, uh, Akufuado and Alan, mm. all from the South. This time, you have Baumia and Alan, mm. both satisfied. Mm. So. I would want a certain consensus to be built within the party to have the two of them run, run together. together. Interesting. It will save us an acrimonious. And you know, the party provides that when we are in office, the primary should be in the election year. Yeah. So it's going, to, hmm. it's, going to, it's going to avoid an acrimonious primary, which wow. the party may not recover fully from. And then um, we'll have a smooth and have the peace of mind to concentrate fully with, the, with a, a, a united party for the 2024. That is my view. And I, I would like, if the party, uh, we can get like-minded thinking yeah, so we that. can see how we can build that consensus. consensus. As to who becomes running mate and who and becomes president, the, the we can leave it to them. them. Once the party feels that is the way to go, we leave it to the two of them to sort it out. Okay. Um, so that is my view. Right. But I agree with you that the organization of, this, of these elections, mm. especially the presidential elections, mm. how successful that we are able to do it mm. without dividing the party too much will be crucial okay. in, in, our, in our chances for 20. All right, let's end this conversation on what's happening here uh, with um, 